I'm taking the over. Indeed. So it's Wyoming in the road, gold with Brown and Colorado in the home white. Big fella taking it in. Ooh. Wyoming bench that Colorado was out of bounds in the first bucket to come at the 16 minute mark. Try and get the resume looking worthy of a good seat. Well, these games are vitally important. You're going you're gonna to get second in the Pac 12, and it's because they returned so much talent. A slice in and Bay with the rebound. Got it to their guy. That's where they're trying to get baskets. Banks open on a Sunday. Oh, hey, Banks open. Opportunity. That would answer your earlier question. Yeah. Oh, that's why they're doing it. They're just trying to create an opportunity to get out in the open floor. I like that look. Shane, uh, pardon me, Jake Hendricks. They practiced in this building, right? This morning. Yeah. Great pass. Great interior pass. Tyler Bay. Basket. Maldonado. Mm. Got it. AK is getting about 17 a night. Sorry to interrupt, but Wyoming is 3 for 17, and they're tied at the under five. Mm. It's the number 23 team in the country. Yeah, what an opportunity, and McKinley Wright gets it to roll home. Defensively, I wish you would pick up more than 35% of our checks. Yeah. He's trying to drive it here, and he's got an angle and a good finish. Been a stifling defense. Coming in at 3-3 three and three in the season. Oh, two wins in a row, an impressive win against a good Louisiana team. And he fought with the splash. Looking at about a three-possession game. Huge, huge opportunity right here for Colorado, and you got your best player downhill. Mm. Good action, good left-handed finish by Maldonado. He's definitely going to get a shot. Could get the last shot of the half if they could get a stop here. They brought the double again. Batty pounds his way down the lane. They, do, they have always done a really good job. Defending the three. Good back tap there. You're going to get a shot late. In the Four on the clock. Hesitated. Oh, rolls home. And Gatling makes his first field goal of the game to tie the game at the half. That was probably very frustrated, but if you're Wyoming, you're right where you want to be. Maldonado continues to be aggressive in the half court, but defensively, you have done an incredible job of staying in the game. And I'm sure Colorado did. Kick. Schwartz has been the go-to guy in the dish to pay with a jam. Colorado's got its largest lead of the game at six. With the unselfish play off penetration to the Buffs' leading scorer, Tyler Bay. Game. 6'10 center hit six threes last time out against Louisiana. An overtime win. Corner three. It's Schwartz again. That's Koontz this time, Dalen Koontz. Glad you brought your abacus. <laughs> Bay with the stop. Numbers for Colorado. And McKinley Wright with a burst to the rim. Defense leading to offense, speed in the open floor. 18 0 run now, and I'll count that one. Chance for a three point play for TJ Taylor. Maldonado. Nice feed. They get it deep, and the left hand hook goes for TJ Taylor. Left hand in that mid post. Let's see if they can return the favor. He is long, and he's able to put it off the window. The two for seven on the season. That was a rhythm three. Trying to increase tempo. Good drive there. A finish for Kenny Foster. Maldonado. Got it. Great well, screen. Not going anywhere. The double. Great pass. Caught that one. Got to finish this now. I'm shocked they didn't get an offense. I thought there was a discard. He's saying flopping again. Much pressure per square foot. He discarded with the left arm because textbook wise, you're not supposed to extend. With Evan Batty all afternoon or all night or whatever it happens to be here in Vegas. There are no clocks in your mindset. Greg Milton gets the bucket to go. Colorado now playing really late in the clock. Tough pull up, but it's amazing, Tom. You Good defense there by Gallant off the bounce. Maldonado is going to get an open path for the basket. Slices his way in. He's got 14, 15. Two big misses there. Oh, good strong move. 
Get to your spot. Pull up. Go up. game. Playing, he's playing with some real confidence. Another good double. Another good location. Maddox Daniels for three. Not coming up to trap. The trapping is only happening with the top two guards. So if you can get it to the middle of the floor deep enough, they won't trap you. Good penetration to a pitch. We're back to a four-point game. Hendrick Strong. The skip from Batty along two. Great position to kept that ball alive. Bay will finish it. That's the update. Hendricks gives it up. That last foul, by the way, was on Austin Mueller. It was his third. Hendricks has it blocked. If Colorado could have come away with that cleanly. McKinley right makes him pay. He tried that earlier in the half. And there's rebound number 18 for Bay. Great pass. Career high in rebounds, and now he picks up another assist. We talked about Wyoming's issues as it related to scoring the basketball, but he's a guy that was getting them around eight and change a game, has yet to score tonight. I like this round Schwartz. The ball came right to him. He's like, well, I'm just going to shoot it. Team with the first three, four possessions of the second half got Colorado back going. Movement by the Cowboys. And there he is. Goes for Hunter Thompson. Goes deeper to the bench. Dallas Walton in the game for the first time tonight. Schwartz cut off out to Seward. I love it. Schwartz playing off two feet. Cape quality win on a neutral site. A leak out ahead. Taylor blocked oh. by Seward. Earned. I was thinking, let him go, but you know better than that. They're not going to let him go. Kid got up and made a play. Back on the floor for Wyoming. Colorado will run out the clock. And the Buffaloes. Led in scoring by Schwartz with 12. It came mostly in the second half, 10 since the break. And Tyler Bay with a career high in rebounds. He had 19 of his team's 41. Batty had 13 on the glass. And despite shooting just 38%, Tab Boyle's team is able to pull away and they outscore Wyoming by 15 in the second half.